We have to step it up, guys. The Super Trophy Tournament is almost over, and Team Black Ghost just earned a lot of points with their last win. Right, Sandra. Tony Parker somehow got his competitive edge back. But his style is still the same. He'll always play dirty if he can get away with it. And all the other teams are upgrading to Turbo 2 power now that they've seen it in action. Maybe we should go as well. Good news, everyone. Did we also upgrade to Turbo 2, Uncle John? Well, I'd say we did something much more revolutionary than that, Sandra. Hmm. Turbo 2 is yesterday's news. May I present Draker's Turbo Power Level 3? Fabulous! Wow. Ah. <sighs> Congratulations. Your crew must have been working non-stop. And you'll be able to see it in action this morning. Razor was equipped with new Turbo 3, while Ventura runs on Turbo 2. Razor's unstoppable. Yes, indeed. We have to run a few more tests, but I'm optimistic that this is a game changer. I'd say your engineers are racing faster than we ever could. Uncle John, when can we use the Drakers Turbo 3? We'll be testing it on your illustrious competition. It'll make Team Black Ghost see red. Draker red. By the way, Sandra, where's our champion? Mm -hmm. I gave him time off to recover from the accident. I doubt the reporters will let him. That little love triangle he's in has been front page news for days now. We'd just like to have a word with him, ma'am. Please, he needs his peace and quiet. But Aunt Rosanna, there must be some news you can give us. Did he quit racing? Is it true that he's heartbroken? He's just recovering from a serious accident. He'll be back and more determined than ever. Now please leave or I'll call the police. Mm -hmm. These journalists are bigger pests than mosquitoes. Well, they're doing their job and I should get back to doing mine. It's the only way to get Nina off my mind. Have you told her that? What? Why should I? She don't care for me a little bit. The last thing I need is to see her face to face. We're finished. That girl is not being sincere with you, or even with herself. Nina made it very clear. She's not interested in me or Eric. I need to accept that and move on, or I'll go crazy. Ugh. Hmm. There's nothing more relaxing than washing a car, especially when you have a car like the Hello or the Janez, which have unique personalities all of their own. To the showcase room! Hello, Chris. Hello, Fabry. I hope both of you guys are in the mood to be pampered. Like Greek athletes before the race. I bet Lolly and Kabir's cars aren't this spoiled. Should we give them a little show? Hit the accelerator, my bro! The next Super Trophy race is happening in our hometown. The fans are expecting a lot from us. It's one thing to finish second or third, but we've really got to step it up and take home a first place finish. Hey, Fabri. What's going on over there, my man? We've got a mutiny on our hands. Your cars told our cars that you give them massages. <laughs> That's one of the drawbacks of having cars that can talk to each other. And when they say massage, what they really mean is that we wax them every we day. We could use your help. What kind of wax does your team use, Kabir? We have a bunch of different kinds in the garage. I'll go take a look and see what we have. Hang on, and tell those two cars they'll have to be patient. Drivers from rival teams being friendly? Weird, huh? Mm. But Kabir can make friends with almost anyone. And can you make friends with anyone? I don't have any time now for friendship. I just want to win the Super Trophy. That's all I really care about. Mm. Hello, racing fans. Welcome to the heart of the jungle circuit. Our drivers are competing to qualify in the Formula Kids division of the Super Trophy of India. Team Hurricane grabs second place. The mysterious Zack will now be lining up with Bravo and Morelli when the qualifying round begins. Whoever this kid is, he's become a superstar. So you're not interested in her at all? 
Glad to hear it. And yet the papers are reporting on a romance. What's the full story? There is none. It's not my fault that journalists just make up lies to sell papers. Excuse me, but you were seen arguing with Red Fury over this woman. It was caught on television. That's not true at all. We were discussing something else, but if you want the truth, my heart really belongs to another woman. What other woman, Eric? I really can't divulge her name, but she knows who she is. In fact, she's very close to me right now. I wish I could believe that. Huh? Huh? Who is this woman? Huh? My name is Helga, Ed Mitchell's mother. I'm desperate for any word about my son. That kid driver? Why? What happened to him? One moment. I'd like to get an exclusive interview. We have with us the mother of Ed Mitchell. As you may have heard, he vanished a few days ago and no one knows his whereabouts. Well, it would appear that Margot has an unscheduled guest on her program today. Let's see what she has to say. Hmm. Hmm. At first, I thought Ed went to see his father in Los Angeles, but I was told he hadn't, and later I received this mysterious letter. Ms. Mitchell, can you tell our viewers exactly what was written in that letter you received? Mom, don't be afraid I'm fine. I have to go my own way right now. When I've found what I'm searching for, I'll tell the whole world. That's a very cryptic letter, ma'am. He just says that he's searching for something? Do you know what it is? I have an idea. When we last spoke, he was talking about an x raw field. What did he say about an x raw field? Not much, but I think he's joined the Rivera brothers to go <coughs> look for it. <sighs> Mr. Gotan, is everything okay? No, it is not. Someone go down there and pull this woman off the air. Good job, gentlemen. Excellent. First and third place. You really can't ask for much better than that. Have you heard the statement from Ed's mother? It's all over every TV station. What do you think happened to Ed Mitchell? It's weird that Ed has disappeared, just like Bob and Luke. If we did lose track of the Rivera brothers, it's because they were trying to escape. There is, however, something about this Ed Mitchell story that doesn't quite ring true. I agree, and it's very suspicious. Margot, keep an eye on the mother, and try to figure out who is behind all of this. I'm tired of staying in this dump. Only a few days more, honey. Be patient. We have to let the story catch fire. But I'm going stir-crazy. This place is really the pits. Look at this. We don't even have Wi-Fi, Mom. What's up with that? Don't worry, Ed. I've checked your social media. You won't believe how many new likes you've gotten. You're even trending now. You'll be a star before you know it. So you think we can get a book deal out of it? Honey, your appearance fees will skyrocket, and I'm sure you'll get the starting spot on your team. Don't be so hard on yourself, Stan. Although your qualifying time wasn't your best, I'm sure you'll knock our socks off in the race. You can count on me, coach. Promise. I always do, Stan. You're the greatest. Hmm? Here's my other champion. Everything good with your car? Gentlemen, your engines will now run faster with Turbo 2, so I need you to practice day and night. Mm-hmm. My theory is, Zack isn't here for the purpose of racing. Well, what could it be, Rika? Not sure. If someone is dishonest with you from the start, you're usually up to no good, Stan. Is everything okay, Stan? For sure, Nivaldo. Listen to me. Teamwork saved man from extinction, and teamwork is what will lead our team to victory. Count on it. Hmm? Well, racing fans, an anxious crowd has gathered here today at the heart of the jungle circuit. Who will come out on top in this first round of the Super Trophy of India? Chris Bravo, Zach or Fabri, Lolly, Kabir or Stan Murphy, Tony Parker or Cliff Gibbon? Which of these drivers will achieve X-Racer? And who will take home that bonus x raw Activate X-Racer! We are the Drakers, Drakers contact, contact and Ignition! Contact and setup is complete. And they're off! Bravo is out 
in front. Molly Suri is edging her way past Morelli. The mysterious act for Team Hurricane is about to slip into third place if she passes him. Let's go for the jugular, sis. Don't let friendship get in the way. Excellent stuff. Maintain those positions. Got it? We'll begin loading Turbo 2 right away. We're gonna give the home crowd quite a thrill, but be careful. The cars are entering track one of the Heart of the Jungle Circuit. There are plenty of hidden obstacles, not to mention a crazy maze called the Daedalus. The drinkers are killing us out there. You've got to do better. Yeah? Well, how about an X-Card? Don't get impatient, Tony. We must hold on to our X-Cards until we really need them. We simply can't afford to not win this first round. Bravo is still in the lead, but Lolly Suri is practically glued to his tailpipe. Caution, speed incline. Reduce speed to 50 miles per hour. Fabri is closing in. Chris, you can overtake Zach. There's a long stretch of straightaway coming up. Listen carefully now. This could be your big chance. Recommending increase in speed. Watch out, Zach. Morelli is serious. Wow! Fabri Morelli just passed Zach of Team Hurricane. The Drakers fans are going crazy in the stands. Oh, Fabri, go, go Drakers! Go, Fabri, go Drakers! It's time, Tony. You have to be ready to use your first X card, okay? Young, he should use it now. All right, Tony, use it. So, how about a little swim? I wouldn't mind cooling off the other drivers, Tony. Let me introduce X card power Black Ghost Turbo 2. Benox is up to something, Chris. I'm not sure how to proceed. Parker is going to splash water on his opponents. He'll try to pass you at the next intersection. Assuming he'll be getting there first. Say goodbye, loser Zachary. Visibility compromised. Visibility compromised. Stay the course, Zach. Keep driving straight. Zach is veering off the track. One more little lamb bites the dust. Oh. For Zach of Team Hurricane, this race is a waterlogged wipeout. Radishes. Now listen up, Stan. We can't afford any more slip-ups. You got it. Remember, whoever wins this first round will win bonus x roll and brand new X-Cards. Tony Parker tries to put some distance between himself and the other cars. Only the first six drivers to cross the finish line will move on to the second round in the Super Trophy of India. Kids, we're having problems loading Turbo Pool. Wait a sec, almost there. Having problems, Coach? But we need it now. Do the next card, Kabir. X card rush, mega sprint. Kabir Suri uses an X card to catch up to Morelli. Morelli is holding him off. He did it. Kabir passes Morelli and his own sister, Lolly. Hey, that's not fair, Kabir. Just following your example. What a comeback! Kabir Suri roars past his opponents. He must want to win this one for the whole crowd. It's what happens when cars get regular massages. Quiet, Janice. It's going to be our turn. Go ahead, Chris. Next card rush, overwhelming turbine. Want to play rough, is that it? Hang in there, Tony. Stick to the plan. Bravo has done it! He's just taken the lead away from Tony Parker and Team Black Ghost! Yeah! But 
the most challenging part of today's race is still to come. Each driver has to find the quickest way out of this crazy maze. Pay attention, Tony. Kabir Suri is right behind you. He's looking to pass you. I know there's not much room here, but I'm gonna pass you. Fat chance, sucker! Kabir Suri and Tony Parker are fighting for second place. Hitting the brakes ought to calm you down, punk. What are you doing, Parker? Get out of my way! Whoa! A bad break for Kabir Suri. Unfortunately, that path is going to take him even deeper inside the maze. Parker's questionable move frees him to catch up with Chris Bravo. Bravo's holding him at bay, but this maze can be tricky, and one false move can lead to a major setback. We haven't seen much from Cliff Gibbon in this race, but that's about to change, because he's charging down a path that can only end badly for him. Tony Parker is once again out in front as he and Bravo continually vie for first place. He was doing so great until he hit that maze. Come on, Chris. This is it, Chris. Oh, you're really close now. All right, fans, here they come down the stretch. It's... Go, Chris! Go, Chris! Go, Drakers! Go, Drakers! Go, Chris! Go, Drakers! Tony Parker coming in at first place, followed by Bravo and Kabir. The bonus X Raw will go to Team Black Ghost. Yeah. They can also count on brand new yeah. X cards to use in the next race. Hmm. You're the dirtiest player I've ever known. You better watch it, Kabir. I'm feeling charitable right now, but I might learn to break the habit. You know what I'm saying? Margo, you were right. The mouse took us to the cheese. Sponsors have been emailing me all day. I think it's almost time for you to make a glorious return. Then the money will really roll in. <sighs> what if I say the x raw spoke to me? What do you think? Too crazy, right? Maybe it would be better to say something like, I want to tell you about the x raw field, but the Rivera brothers swore me to secrecy. We're going to make a fortune, right? I don't think huh? so. Huh? Huh? Hmm. Margot Duval. Why are you here? These cheap locks are no match for a top newswoman. What do uh. you want? My son just returned tonight. We'll have a press conference tomorrow. You can speak to us then. Now please leave. Oh, I doubt anyone will show up. Billy's directional mic has recorded everything you said. They're good for exposing scams, Helga. And you two have been busted. I knew it. I knew it would end like this. Thanks, Mom. My whole TV career is ruined now because of you. Hmm. Well, you're in luck, Ed. Team Black Ghost doesn't like bad publicity. I'm here to present you with a foolproof way out. Hmm? Huh? Hmm. The mystery of Formula Kid driver Ed Mitchell's disappearance has been solved. It was feared that, like Bob and Luke Rivera, Ed had gone off in search of the mythical x raw field. But it turns out he was only chasing his lifelong dream. Ed Mitchell is now a figure skater. He only left racing to take part in the upcoming International Ice Follies. Look at that form! Let's all wish him the best of luck and remember to always follow your heart. Margot Duval huh? signing off. His dream was to be a figure skater? Yeah, and he looks pretty good. 
I wonder if Bob and Luke Rivera ever found that x raw field. We haven't heard from them. All too true. Not since we discovered their videotape. I wonder if we'll ever see them again. There it is! There's the hut! Let's go in! I've been waiting for you. Are you Vosha? I am called that. We were told to come find you and that you would help us. I know what you are seeking. If that's true, then you must know where the x raw field is located. Follow me, Rivera Brothers. Vosha, you're going to take us to the x raw field? I am. Hmm. Yeah, it's them all right. How did you get these photos? Someone sent them to me in an email. The Riveras are in contact with some Drakers fans who keep me up to date on the Riveras' whereabouts. But where were these taken, Hector? The jungles of Brazil. Near the Amazon. Near the x raw field? Maybe. I wish we could find them. Should we try? Well, we could take a flight to Brazil. Now that's a great idea. We don't know exactly where Bob and Luke Rivera are, Fabri. What if they need our help? Maybe they're in trouble. Fabri, there's no way to know that. Maybe we should find out. Maybe there is a way to contact them. Just growing up a giant tree, best friend champion. 